you give yourself that energy of, oh, I can do this. I need people. I need my friends. I need my community, but I don't need, I hate to say it like in quotes, the business or the industry. I don't need to be approved by them. I'm creating my own thing. If you've got something, let it rip. I'm never gonna do this again. Everybody grapples with this idea that you're really a fraud. Like I'm alive. And that's when it clicked with me. I thought these are not superheroes. These are just men that can do super things. Welcome back to Monday Morsels, the mini version of 10,000 No's. I'm Matthew Del Negro, and the following clip is raw and unscripted. It's a real world problem solving conversation with one of the members of our 10,000 No's Insiders community. I love it. it. Everybody is really kind of taking matters into their own hands. And that's, you know, I feel like it's, it's not, it's almost not even an option anymore. You have to do that dual approach of play the game of climbing the, the mountain. I won't say the corporate ladder because it's not really corporate, but it's the version, it's acting's version of the corporate ladder, you know, get your credits, do things, you get a bigger role, a bigger role, they see you in this, now it's a recurring, now you're right, you could do that. But I, I really believe at the same time, doing these other things on your own, it, it's going to, one, it's going to empower you. It's going to just bring you what I was saying that Ayla has right now. She's got, I, I said that renaissance, you can see it because I could see it in everybody that I just mentioned, Bryce, same thing. It's like, you give yourself that energy of, oh, I can do this. I need people. I need my friends. I need my community, but I don't need, I hate to say it like in quotes, the business or the industry. I don't need to be approved by them. I'm creating my own thing. And, and you have something physical to show for it. And you've also developed, you know, producerial skills that help not only you, but they might, you might end up being, you know, helpful to someone else. I said to Bryce uh, a couple of weeks ago, hey, now that you got through the minutia of figuring out the paperwork for SAG for your short film, you can become a resource for other people just like you who are about to do it because you just went through it. So create the handbook that other actors come to. That's going to bring actors to you when you become a hub. Now you're going to have more opportunities to collaborate and it just builds everything builds upon that. All right, that is it. Now, obviously you can just take what was said and apply it to your own life. But if you like what you heard so much that you want to find out how you can become a part of this community, just click the link for 10,000 nose insiders in the show notes or visit 10,000 nose.com and check out more details there. If you feel like this helped you, please consider helping us by rating, reviewing, and subscribing to the podcast. Or if you're watching on YouTube, by liking this video, subscribing to our channel, and dropping a comment below. We appreciate it and have a great week.